Welcome back to another video on how to overcome approach anxiety. I have a new uh, microphone, so things should be much, much clearer now. And I'm still trying to figure out the best position, but let's get straight into it. Now, every guy has approach anxiety, me, you, everyone, okay? And the one thing is that it's never going to go away, okay? You could do it a thousand times, it's never going to go away. You are still going to be that little bit nervous after the thousandth time as you were after the first time. The only difference is that it's maybe a little bit less and you have a better understanding of the potential opportunities that can come from just approaching. All right. So number one, I want you to accept the fear. The fear is not going to go away. Just accept it. You know, I get that when you see a girl, you know, your heart starts racing, you feel very excited on the inside. And let's, why don't we view that as something a bit more positive? Instead of, let's say, it's not fear, it's just excitement, right? Disguising itself as fear, okay? That's all it is, you know, everything starts rushing around in your body and you start getting a bit overwhelmed. But if you're able to slightly control that and just take action immediately instead of dwelling on, on the fear and overthinking, you're going to go extremely far. So remember, accept. Accept the fear. Don't fight it. Number two, yes, I get it that if you approach a girl, you feel there's a lot of social pressure around you, especially nowadays. Oh, you know, you have those white nights. Oh, is the, is the girl okay? Is he harassing her? Blah, blah, blah. No, 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 no. That is ridiculous. You are overestimating other people's fuck-giving levels. Their fuck giving levels are extremely low, okay? And yeah, so what? You know what? If a guy sees you approaching a girl, he's probably going to be jealous more than anything anyway. And girls are going to be jealous because you're approaching them, uh, approaching another girl and not them, all right? So stop overestimating their fuck levels because they don't care, all right? Just make sure that when you approach, you're keeping a reasonable distance and you're not getting too much in the girl's face to make her feel uncomfortable. And apart from that, keep approaching. Now the next one is social butterfly. This is particularly extremely important just in your everyday life. If you're at work, talk to people. If you're in the supermarket, talk to people. On the bus, talk to people. Talk, 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 talk. The idea is you're getting used to social interactions with strangers, okay? And it should become second nature to you anyway, because you learn a lot of social skills from that and how to act with people. And you'll start to understand that actually, even though there are 7 billion odd people in the world, there are extreme similarities between a lot of people where certain things just click. And you find these things that click much easier by just being social with everyone. Guys, girls, people you're not interested in, whatever, it doesn't matter. Just be social. And also you're training yourself to to understand that um, everyone is a friend. You know, strangers are friends you haven't met yet. Right? That's a good little thing to, to do, uh, to think. Okay, the next one is be water, not ice. What I mean by that is you need to be flexible. You need to understand that it is going to be a little bit awkward at first uh, when you approach a girl because she's like, who the fuck is this? And you're like, oh my God, I'm, I'm talking to a girl, what the fuck? Okay, so it's going to be very awkward. So you need to be like water. You need to be fluid. You need to just go with the flow. Okay, go with the flow of the conversation. You know, if you approach a girl you go, and you start eating your own words, like, hey, I just wanted to, uh, 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 like this. In that moment, you just need to be, you just need to say to her, one second. Okay, anyway, and take a deep breath and just continue. The reason you do that is you need to compose yourself. If you're composed, she's composed too, all right? So that is extremely important for you to do. And also it's confident as well. You need to be on your own time, okay? Because you're the man and you should be on your mission in life and, you know, you're approaching her, you're taking the risk. So it needs to be in your time, not hers. Start walking before thinking. Yeah, this is a big one because if you see a girl and you just think, wow, she's beautiful, I should approach her, oh, maybe she's got a boyfriend, maybe she doesn't want to be approached, oh, she looks angry, maybe she's busy. All these thoughts are going through your mind, and they're all against what you want to do, okay? 
So, you see beautiful girl. Okay, cool. I'm going to approach. Go. And start walking towards her. Okay? Don't let your intrusive thoughts enter your mind too much and ignore them. Okay? It's, they're trying to talk you out of it. Right? You need to get a better control of your mind in order to ignore it and just continue going forward and talking. So, start walking. Then think afterwards. Okay? Approach. Then deal with the interaction during the interaction. Yes, it is a skill, but the more you do it, the easier it gets. I promise you, okay? Next one is missing out on opportunities. This is the last one. So you've just seen a girl. You're like, oh, shit, she was she was hot. Okay, maybe I should approach. Okay, and maybe I should. Okay, oh, she's walking past. Oh, it's too late. Fuck, I should have approached. Why didn't I approach? Oh, my God. What you should do is turn around and just watch her walk away. Just Just watch that opportunity gone forever. And make yourself feel bad about it because you should. Okay, I know it's difficult, but you know the let's say the rewards of life don't come easily. You need to work at it. You need to understand that every girl that you see that you find attractive is a is an opportunity, and if you miss out on that opportunity, it's your fault and your fault only. All right, so take responsibility um, and try to use it as a catalyst for the next girl. Like fuck, okay, next time I'm gonna approach. And the thing is as well, you need to understand that the words that you tell yourself have to have strong meaning. If you tell yourself one thing and you do something else, then why should anyone listen to you? You don't even listen to your own words, all right? So you need to make sure that your words are solid ground, okay? Okay, let me just say hi to this girl or let me just compliment her. To be honest, that's what something else you can do to make things easier. It ties in with social butterfly as well. Is that just compliment people. Guys, girls, anyone, whatever, it doesn't matter. Compliment. You don't need to stop them and then compliment them and expect a reaction. No, no, no. If you're walking past someone and they have nice shoes, you are like, oh, cool, nice shoes, by the way. Or, oh, nice dog, by the way. As you're walking past, and don't stop. The worst thing that's going to happen is they're going to ignore you. Oh, great, okay. But to be honest, if someone compliments you in the street randomly, you're going to feel good, aren't you? So at least you're going around making people feel good, number one. And number two, you're getting used to just breaking that barrier with people very easily. And also you're spreading some good, good shit around as well, so... That's always nice. Um, so yeah, these are the, the six um, points that you should take into consideration uh, when you uh, overcome approach anxiety. Um, yeah, these six, uh, six here are the best ones. And you need to just, just do it every day. You need to put yourself in certain these positions every single day. And trust me, it's very easy. Oh, you go to the shop? Why don't you talk to the assistant? Excuse me, I'm just looking for this. Even if it's like that, basic conversation about what you want, joke around, done. Okay, thank you, bye. Done. That's a social interaction right there. Okay, every little helps. All right, perfect. Well, if you have any questions, let me know. Uh, let me know how your approaches go as well. I'm always interested to hear how people are doing. And I will see you in the next video. Like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz. And see you next time.